so after enjoying the gorgeous views outside I am just about to enter into the Dubai mall and then access the fountain area from inside oh it was a great view I took some great pictures and yeah I just, I'm just waiting for the light show and the fountain to start because I know the pictures over there are gonna be even better yeah I think I've got quite the walk left okay as usual I'm lost and I've just entered there are clear directions but the sheer size of the mall really makes it a bit confusing at times uh, I can see the um, aquarium again I was here just a couple of hours ago okay so mission fountain right now I'm gonna talk to you guys once I find the fountain or at least the road to the fountain completely different from the afternoon now you have all the locals enjoying weekend outing at the mall we also got some tourists so everyone's just having a great time and I'm still searching for the fountain by the way Views are absolutely insane. done with the fountain show and it was definitely worth it it was worth it to come all the way because yeah in the morning when you go up the uh, Burj Khalifa like I've said before if you've been on top of the Eiffel Tower then Burj Khalifa won't really impress you a lot the views from the Burj Khalifa but yeah it's an achievement to have been at the top of the world's tallest building uh, that's something yeah otherwise the fountain show in front of the Burj Khalifa that in the evening is definitely a must so after enjoying the fountain I'm gonna take the red line again the red line of Dubai Metro to continue this evening at the Dubai Marina the Dubai Marina has awesome architecture as well and I feel that it should be visited at night there are some amazing restaurants as well uh, overall it's a great place to hang out in the evening
Okay, so see you there. So <laughs> this place is so awesome that it makes me want to move over here right now.